I am Mel Taylor, and this is Local Media Disrupted. We try to make digital marketing easy. WordPress, how about it? As of today, 22% of the web is powered by this thing called WordPress. Ten years ago, it kind of started out just as a blog, but then it turned into a full-blown content management system, a CMS. As of today, do you see the news reports? See that guy right there? That's Matt Mullenweg. He's the guy behind a company called Automatic. They're behind this thing called WordPress and WordPress.com. They are looking for an investor. And the word on the street is they're trying to raise about $100 million. And what uh, Wall Street believes is that that place is a $1 billion valuation on WordPress. Think about that if you're the person who's in charge of writing the check every month or every year for that vendor selling you some kind of proprietary system. Think about that. Oh, to make matters worse and to make you squirm a little more, WordPress released 3.9 today. WordPress 3.9 Smith, named after jazz great Jimmy Smith, is all about closing the gap between what you see when you're editing your posts and site layout and what you get when you send it out into the world. From gallery, video, and audio previews right in the visual editor, to live widget previews, we're closing the gap between editing and publishing, saving you time and giving you a much better idea of how everything's going to look before you hit publish. And editing images and other media has been transformed too. Galleries look great in your final posts, but until now you've only had a placeholder to look at when you're putting those posts together. In 3.9, your galleries are right there, just as they'll appear in your live post. Editing images is also a lot simpler now, giving you the chance to scale them right from the visual editor and access cropping and rotation with much greater speed. And even getting images into posts is now as simple as dragging them right from your desktop and into the post itself, with no extra step in between. And just as images have galleries, in 3.9 you can put together playlists of your audio and of your videos. The same ideas follow through when it comes to customizing your site. From the theme customizer, you're now able to preview, add and rearrange widgets, taking the guesswork out of how they'll impact on your site and getting them just right before you commit to them going live. Headers can also be uploaded and tweaked from right within the customizer, saving you more back and forth and letting you crop and manage headers where it matters most, when you're customizing your theme. And speaking of themes, in 3.9 finding a new one is a whole new, much richer experience thanks to the addition of the visually driven theme browser. Add hundreds of behind the scenes changes and improvements and WordPress 3.9 leaves you with a simpler, cleaner way to edit your content and your site by seeing exactly what you'll be getting before you take your updates live. WordPress 3.9 Smith, closing the gap between your vision and your content. That's right, version 3.9, huge, great stuff. So how much will it cost us? How long will it take us to upgrade everything? Let me think about that. Let's see, I got a calculator here, carry the one, one, two, five. How much will it cost us to upgrade from 3.8 to 3.9 with all those great new tools? and um, applications that are baked right into the core of WordPress. You know how much it's going to cost us? Nothing. That's right. Zero. Zilch. How much is it going to cost you? How much will it cost you to upgrade your platform? How long will it take to upgrade your platform? Do you have to lock in for a full 12 months? That's nice. 